Hi guys and welcome back. So tonight we're going to be watching episodes 13 and 14 of Great Pretender. In this video we're going to be watching episode 13 posted for Monday and episode 14 on Tuesday. So we are in the middle of this whole painting situation. There's an auctioner called James that is auctioning off paintings but having this girl Farah, this lady, grown woman Farah, end up paying for them and then he keeps them. However, the latest painting, Snow of London, ended up being bought by our crew as we know it. Um, and then what they're going to end up doing, I believe, is selling it to Farah, but a fake. And with this, we learned about Cynthia and her romantic past. It was adorable, and it seems like she still has connections with her ex because she knows a painter that can reproduce paintings very well, and you can do that. <laughs> so anyways, I was really excited to continue watching this. I had to obviously stop it last week, but here we are getting right back into it. So I am hype. Without further ado, guys, let's go. Peut-être que c'est une bonne idée si je parle français. <laughs> Qu'est-ce que vous pensez? I'm gonna call him a wanker. Oh, you guys also told me that the Chris girl from her shop was actually the Chris that we met later on. That's so cool. What is happening? On est en France, alors peut-être je devrais parler en français. Like, I don't know. No, my spontaneous French is not good though. <laughs> like, I slur my words, I mess up everything. Guys, if they were really in love, I really hope they can rekindle and just... How did they part? How did she part with her? <laughs> I want to pinch his cheeks. Are they gonna be married? Stop. Peut-être on peut se marier. Ah! I go crazy! I feel like he ruined everything somehow. She's not happy. I think he goes with it and then she's not happy about all of it. This sounds too good for him. I think he goes along with it and it just tarnishes their ideals. Like, comment est-ce qu'ils vont savoir? Like, how will you be able to know the real one at that point, really? I guess testing the paint, you know? Oh my god. That's too sweet to... Ah! That's too sweet to pass over for him. Did he start distancing because he didn't know what to do, or did he end up doing it after all, and... <gasps> oh, so he chose to do it. Yeah, he chose to do it. Oh, Farrah Toffee? Is that her? Is she, does she, what, is that her, her, like, her company? Like, she makes those things? Oh, that's, like, dirty money. <laughs> I think what happens is they get caught and what does he blame? Or does he make a mistake? That is sad. It's sad. His passion, now he doesn't create his own art anymore. He's just... So if they just distanced because of something like this, can they rekindle? <laughs> it doesn't seem like he broke her heart, like, you know, he, like... 
Okay, no, I don't think so, to be honest. He looks really good. Like, he looks cute before, but now he looks like... Okay, because you know how I am about ear piercings, okay? I really like earrings, like, a lot. And he got an undercut? Bro, he got an undercut. His swag looks totally different. Like, I didn't even realize that this was his style. Like, I felt like his style before was, like, so much more modest. Like, humble. But you know what, honestly, like, trust me, money does bring come with a glow up. Like, it just happens. Like, I get it. It's not crazy. But I just didn't realize this was actually his taste. Earrings and an undercut? Like, okay, sir. And a white suit. I can understand how this affects her. You know, he's, he's not even aware of, like, what he's doing. And as an artist, I just don't blame him either. You know, when you're an artist and you've been struggling for a while to come out as anybody, this thing thrown at you is just such an opportunity you're like yo my skills of reproduction maybe this is what they're for like nah, nah, nah. like maybe this is what i can do like i don't blame him at all but i understand how this can get like wonky <laughs> like any okay you can get money at some point but that doesn't mean you need to suddenly change like how invested you are in luxuries like you'll order the most expensive one after all like when did you start being so bougie and extra about the taste of wine you know, like, when did that happen? He should save. Save. See? That's what I just said. Yo, you need to save. This is why people need to know how to use money. Because... Even if he's doing this right now, as long as she's confident that he knows that he can save and really hustle that money for something different and better, like... <gasps> I hate this. I really do. This is sad. I understand both. Like, I'm not even... Ugh. Damn, that poor guy doesn't look like he has any more back to put into nothing. Oh, this is him now. Bro, your girl was right. <laughs> you know, that's a look too, to be honest. You know that look. We all know that look. I'm not sure I'm looking... But then when you think about what she's doing in life... <laughs> Okay, they don't have to be in Kindle. I'm just, you know, good terms. I cannot get over you, Abby. <laughs> Seriously, that's what he wanted? Yo, she wants to break your wrist. Oh, she ordered the same food. Bro, she could say the same for you at the time. Oh, that was him! I didn't even know it is! That was him doing the... <laughs> I thought those were extras. That was him that I said probably has no more back to... <laughs> Why didn't it occur to me? Like, I swear. Oh my god. <laughs> He really should have saved that money, invested, done, been smart with the money. You're like, smart, like, come on now. Yo, the dumbest thing someone could do is when they come across a lot of money and just spend it. Like, what are you talking about? I wonder how she really feels right now. She's putting on such a strong front and such a, like, carefree front.
You know what? <laughs> you want to know what's crazy about this, y'all? She, she didn't judge him in the past, but she judged him in the past. Like, she was like, you're really going to keep doing this, is this, da 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 And even if you're making a lot of money, you're really going to keep living like this? You're going to keep doing this? And then that's what she was saying to him. And then now, even her that was doing things correctly or just not going that route, still didn't become an actress, and now she's a con artist. Goes to show you, huh? Goes to show you, really, like, it's crazy. But I still don't know a ton about Cynthia, like, what happened after all of that, but that's just interesting to see how they really, they reflect each other a lot, actually. Is this true? I guess it's true. I'm not sure if he came of his own accord, if they, like... He still has them. Wait, what? Hold on. Oh, is it? Oh! Oh, you probably make so much money by selling it to a museum. Is that why? Is it because... Is it because Thomas told him he would be selling it, like, to, like, individuals? And then he actually sold it to a museum as, like... Like, a museum? <laughs> like, that's definitely more intense, like... I bought them back. Wow. Yeah, okay, yeah. As an artist, deep down, he had issues with it being in the museum like that, and kids are looking at it, and just, it's just, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's different, it won't be in the museum. Stop. Stop! <laughs> oh my god. How did I know? I didn't know he was gonna draw a ring, but I knew it was marriage. I knew it was marriage. Oh my god, that's a beautiful ring. It's so pretty. Now I really want them to rekindle. Bro, I do want them to rekindle now. Don't even play with me. Bro, if it can happen, I can see them maybe also just closing it off and not like on bad terms, but like I want them to rekindle because I want her to have a happy romantic life at her age. Like, really? He's never been successful. <gasps> Is that real? Do people use like bird feather wings like to paint? That's sick. I didn't know that. Oh, il est complètement concentré maintenant. <laughs> he is completely concentrated right now. <laughs> I feel compelled to speak French because we are en France. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh my god. <laughs> These guys have no idea what's happening right now. <laughs> oh, he is not putting it a point tail. Oh. Bro. I hope he could join the crew. Like become a con artist with all with them. Like, come on now. Is he done? I don't recall which one is the correct one, but I see a difference in the pictures. The hue on this one, the green has a more 
more of a hint of yellow than this one. This one has more of a hint of turquoise. I find it really interesting that they did that even in the show. They didn't make them exactly the same. It's like this one's a bit more faded, the one on the left or something. Is he done or is he not done? Okay, I don't know, but... Yeah. Are you trying to match make? Please? <laughs> yes! Oh my god! Please, I really want a romance in this show, like... And she's a grown woman, to me it looks like she does want love, so like, give it to her. Okay, so that episode was good, I really enjoyed it, seeing, you know, what happened um, in their past after he started making a lot of money and stuff like that, it was unfortunate. But gosh, I was torn, like, I really understand the two. Um, I feel like he could have just been smarter about it, even if he did take this route, never be the one being used. Even if you are being used, make sure you're using too. And although he was using, he was not using to his best potential to his, you know, overall conclusive benefit. And he wasn't, you know what I mean? And, you know, if that was also communicated to Cynthia being like, yo, I'm gonna be in this for another six months, fam. <laughs> I'm investing, I'm saving, I'm saving, I'm doing this, 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 and then I'm out, girl. Like, you know what I mean? And having communicated that, she'd be like supporting you during that time. But she has to see that you're not kind of just settling and just falling into this pit of, of being handed forgeries to make money quick and easy. It's like, but anyways, that was really icky for the two. But, um... And I find it really, really interesting how she ended up being a con artist, too, instead of a, an actress. It goes to show that life, man, life will mess with you. Life will mess with you. You know, no matter how righteous or correct your path is, you will be tested nonstop. Always being tested. And they both ended up not taking the best route. Um, I don't know yet why she failed at becoming an actress. You know, like, we haven't quite seen that side of her story yet. But yeah, you know, Abby and Laurent are doing their thing. We got Ida Muda playing matchmaker, and I hope he's successful, or at the very, very minimum, they could start slow again, and like, just be cool. And honestly, I really hope he joins. He probably won't. He'll probably be given some money and then go off his way in a better way, but like, I really wish that he would just join them. But yeah, so I am going to be off on to episode 14 that you guys will be seeing tomorrow. So that is the end of this video, guys. Thanks a lot for watching. Leave how you feel. Thoughts down below. No spoilers. And I'll see y'all again tomorrow. So thanks and bye.